Whoa there, buddy. Well, that is how you, uh, that, that is how you fire. I am, I am relearning everything. Look at the, oh man, look at the white, never mind. There's like the, the texture pop in is really weird on the ground. Huh. That. Oh, yeah, look at that. All right, that's reflection. Yeah, that's like. the water reflecting off sunlight or it still looks vice really versa. Welcome back to some Uncharted. It, it, it's been a little while for me, but I remember Mr. Hint was telling me to look over this way. Mr. Hint, huh? Yep. Is that um, is that is that a voice in your head, John? You didn't hear him. <laughs> no. Oh dear. Um. Well, the vo get it together. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. <laughs> okay, well, I can't trust the voices, but I'm thinking maybe I should try to go this way. Okay, let's go that way. Um. Where is the way to? Oh, there's stairs. That is the way. I'm trying to do all this climbing, and then there's stairs. There's some climbing. I found climbers. Do climbing. Climbing in progress. Uh, nope. I was kind of hoping for a bigger jump than that. Nathan Drake here isn't exactly Mario. But Merry Christmas. It's what? been a few days since we... Sorry, what were you going to say? No, go on. Um, it has been some time... Because of the Christmas season right. or just general busyness. Oh, okay. I was trying to grab onto, like, windowsills. There we go. The holiday season. Yes. Yeah, what, whatever you do celebrate, I happen to celebrate Christmas. But whatever you celebrate, or if you celebrate nothing, I, I hope you celebrate, have a good one. I celebrate Red and Green <laughs> Atheist Present Exchange Day. Oh, well, how was your Red and Green Atheist Present Exchange? Well, I'm not exchange? actually fully atheist. <laughs> Um, but you, but you okay. observe the holiday. Yeah, as in, as in, I celebrate Christmas, but I, I'm not religious at all. That's cool. I, I really like Christmas. Go, go so down I, on the right. So I say Christmas is for everyone. Oh yeah, that gate was closed. I mean, if I mean, if Japan can do Christmas without with them being like 98 percent. Yeah. Oh, jerks! How do I? There we go. I was not ready for you guys at all. I've only met. I met one person who was like. I am wasting all these They were very religious, but, like, that wasn't the problem. It's more so, I guess, their attitude towards things. Um, yeah. They saw, like, a commercial on TV that was, like, oh, like, on the 26th. It's like, oh, now that Christmas is over, you can blah, 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 our sales, blah, 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 blah. And they made, like, this really, really angry Facebook oh, post about how, like, people who aren't true Christians, like, you should know that it lasts until January something, and that if you don't actually know that, you're not a real Christian and shouldn't be celebrating the holiday anyway, and you should, like, if you're not Man, who still crazy celebrates about, you're not allowed to. Anyway. Like, I was just like, whoa there, that's oh. a little, um... So, speaking as a Christian, someone's to your we're, right. we're not supposed someone's to be to jerks. Right. Someone's, oh, to right. I I... someone's to your right. Someone's to your right. I'm pretty sure there was someone over there you didn't talk. Oh, yeah. yeah, you're right. And he's right. Okay. Grenade him. Quick. That's a good... Oh, there's a grenade up there. For some reason, I was not Get back. getting off. Oh, no, oh, don't jump over... Down. Hide. Stay on there for a little bit. Okay. What do I have? You have a shotgun, not... which is not very useful. You have grenades. Yeah, I think it's going to have to be grenades. <sighs> you, oh. can, you can just... Oh, that's, that's not a great throw. One thing I like about how stealth works in this game, um, is that, that, break that wall. if you um, if you throw a grenade and you're in stealth, you like the enemies get alerted, but they're not alerted to where you are. They just know that someone's there. So you can actually, like, stealth kill a whole set of people with grenades, as long as no one sees you throwing any. That's cool. Ooh, I wouldn't punch him. Usually the bigger hey, guys... So good. Is he a bigger the, guy? Yeah, he had a... He had a bigger weapon. Oh, bigger in that sense. Yeah, like he had a grenade. So like, ooh, grenade launcher. I, I was looking for, like, whether or not he was burly. If he, if he looks like he could... I was Whoa. Felix. That was a powerful magnum. Direct, son. Ooh, 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 ooh. I'm not doing that either. I don't know. My my thing with um, are you a true Christian and whatever, or respecting people who aren't Christian, 
is it says pretty clearly in our Christian doctrine that we're supposed to be nice to people and treat people like our neighbors. So I feel like that supersedes all the other stuff. Oh, God. I'm impressed that that didn't kill you right out. Yeah, I know. I got struck with me. Yo, this guy's getting real annoying. He's he is aggressive. The thing is, we don't have any good weapons. Yeah, I think grenade v grenade. I don't know if I got him. I did not get him. I don't know. He's over there now. Now I got him. That looked like it got him. Yeah. So we really just have the shotgun. Oh, single magnum bullet. Make it count. I think that it. That's the other thing. During a real gunfight, you would not be able to easily tell who was dead and who wasn't. What do you mean? Like, like in this game, there isn't some kind of, like, prompt that happens every time you kill somebody. So in this, you're not always sure if you got the person when you're under heavy fire. You have to actually keep an eye on your targets. Wait, what, what's the prompt in this game, then? No, there. this game doesn't have one. But in other ones, you'd like get a little plus one on the side of the screen, or like, oh, like a or, or like headshot or something. And you could use that to tell yourself like how good your aim was, even though you hit back behind the wall. You, you can you can tell based on like the animation they do. Oh, uh, that's true. But I mean, like that's. I think that's more of what we're saying is good. Yeah, because you still need to have sight of them to know if they died. Ooh, ooh, ooh. And if you didn't see them, then you have to do a little bit of guesswork, or wait for them to fire again. But yes, I had a very nice Christmas. Um, I also had a very nice Atheist Present Exchange Day, which is the same day. Um, oh. Red and green Atheist Present Exchange Day. The oh, distinction right. is very important. Right, it has to be those colors. Uh, Allie got me those Zelda uh, champion amiibos. Oh, all of them? Yeah. Oh, nice. And she, and she said, I, I opened up the first one because they were all in different bags. And I opened up the first one and it was Urbosa. And she was like, now don't get don't get too excited because you know these are really rare. And I'm like, okay, well, thank, but thank you. And then they actually were all four oh. champions. And I was like, you told me not to get excited. And she was like, yeah, bitch. <laughs> yeah, bitch, did you get excited? <laughs> uh, I was pretty excited. And a lot of a lot of my relatives gave me um like restaurant gift cards, so Oh, that's cool. We're gonna be whining and dining. That's cool. I like rarely go out to restaurants. I really only do it if I have a card for it, which is why I love when people give me cards for it. Oh, I need ammo. I really like steak houses, even yeah. though I don't usually get the steak. But oh, like, I, I get the steak. Handy. If I go to a steakhouse, I buy steak. I really like ribs. Those are okay. <laughs> oh, he's so scared. Whoa, yeah, Um, he's getting shot at. Oh, I thought you had him there. That now now I think you have him. Okay. We got screen tearing. Yeah. Er, early PS3 game. It's a little bit ahead of the hardware. Not ahead of the hardware. It's just, it's just technically it's optimized poorly. Because I feel like the other, the newer one games look better, even though they're running on the same hardware. Well, wouldn't it be that, like, over time, though, even on the same console, they kind of learn how to optimize better? That's what I meant. That's okay. what I'm saying. Like, so technically, it's not that it's, like, it's it's harder than the hardware. It's that oh, nice. um, there it's actually just poorly optimized because it's new. I guess that's what I meant. I just didn't have the words for it. Mm. Not. I I'm, slur I'm slowly learning You're slur. more. <laughs> Slurm. No, you are slurring. A little bit. I'm slurring a little. Whoa! <laughs> oh, I'm full of so many bullets, dude. Where, where am I? Where? Um, climb. K. 
Can you climb that telephone pole? Oh, nope, there's a triangle. Pole. Oh, it's a chain. <laughs> no sound. That looked fun. I'm pretty sure that's what I was supposed to do. Okay, so you could get up onto that ledge over there, I guess. Sound going up, no sound going down. And I, I also got L.A. Noir because I never played it when it originally came oh. out, and now I can have it for the Switch. I would have said get it on the, what's it, well, I mean, if it was a gift, it didn't matter, but, because it's just, like, exorbitantly overpriced for the Switch right now. A little bit, because it's treated as a new thing, but. Uh, it's, you can, buy, you can currently buy it for $2. But everything on the Switch is portable. Yeah. And it was, like, I don't know, like. I wanted to try the, the VR adaption of L.A. Noir. There's a VR LA Noir. Yeah, it's a new, it's like a different set of things. It's like designed just for that. It's like 30 bucks, I think. Can they call it LA VR? It's like the VR case files or something is what it's called. Cool. Um, okay, I can't get up there. Pad was showing me the the Vive. That is... Yeah. I've never been that excited about VR, but this made me excited for VR. That's, that's it's, every, it that's is what good quality. It's neat. Like, it's I've tried good. the Oculus Rift and I was like, okay, that's kind of neat. Oh. I have a headache now, though. Hey, wait, was is the tracking just not that good on the Rift? Or I've never actually tried a Rift. Um, I don't know how to explain it. I think it's more because it was such a like. Because the screen resolution is the same on both of them. Yeah. I, I I think it was more of a software thing than a hardware thing, though. Like I think it was the kinds of games I was playing. Uh, what did you play before? Um, there was this one game that cracked me up where you're in class. Oh. It sounded bad. You're in class. You're you're in a class taking a test and you don't know the answers, so you have to cheat. That oh. sounds super fun. You're getting shot at. Yeah. What? Let me try again. They spawned me back in the room with them. Mm -hmm. the kill. Okay. Punch him. Or that. That blood looks so gross. I'm gonna go shotgun because we're but in close quarters. We're doing what? Um. Is there another one? Mm-hmm. Where is not. he? He's over there. No, there is. Come on. Who are you talking to? You're the only person left. He's talking to, uh, the clue, the hint guy. Yeah, you gotta push that. Yeah, so you're you're in a class doing a test. Also, all the, all the students and the teacher are dolphins. I kind of want to try this. And you need to look off of other people's answers, but not get seen by the teacher doing it. Oh, I totally want to try this. I wish I knew what it was called, because then I could look it up and download it. And... I want to try, there's this really cool one at... I think it's at Disney World in the, like, Imagineer department. Oh. Where it's a... Oh. Sorry, I'm having trouble concentrating. I just need to think about what I'm doing. Wait, where? Yeah, I do. Yeah, to the left. I thought I fell into a different area. Oh. To the left, yeah. Mm -hmm. But Pad showed me um, Super Hot VR, which Super Hot is already an amazing game, and it in VR is really the normal. cool. It was redone. It was redone for the VR one. That's all I know. It's like a completely different game, basically. It was really short, but it was neat. What was the one that was really Rick and Morty like? It was called Accounting. It was made by the same people, I believe. Yeah, or at least one of the guys. Mm -hmm. I, I I forget their name, but it wasn't Dan Harmon. It was the other guy. Oh, there's another. There's another. Oh, I was going the wrong way. Here, go grab onto that. Am I just supposed to jump sideways to it? Yes, jump. <sighs> Okay. Now get up higher, and then lean to the right, see if you can jump to the right. Okay, and then I'll... J jump to the right. Well... Okay. Um... But yeah, there's a game called Accounting, and it's hilarious, and if you get a chance to play a Vive and you see it, give it it's a try. It's free. Okay, so I think you have to go the other way now. The way I was going. Okay. But I messed up, because... Oh... Okay. That was close. Whoa. Yeah, that was close. All right. Um, there was another one. There was, like, Lucky's Tale, which was very different. Oh, Super Lucky's Tale. No, normal Lucky's Tale. Oh, then what's the Super Lucky's the Tale? The sequel. 
That is apparently the sequel. The original was what, on the Rift? It was an Oculus Rift launch title that was free. I did and not it know it was still free, so I downloaded it for free. I did not know it existed already. Um, yeah, it's VR only, but it's like a very different type of VR. It's like, it's like you're looking... Can I looking... make that jump? Yeah. It's like you're following, it's like you're following the character in 3D space, but you can look around and stuff. Okay. So it's like everything is 3D and VR, but it's not first person. It sounds really, and you play it for controller. It sounds really weird, but it's, it actually works pretty well. Ooh. Ooh, up and left, I guess. Yeah. Yeah, there's a little rock Jump there. Jump up there. Ooh. What's that? Okay, this is making me super nervous, but we're up. I really want to try getting oh. a, a mod to work with. Oh, Mirror's Edge in VR. Did. Did they ever officially make that? No, but there's a mod you can get to play the original one in it. It's just the mod costs 40 bucks. Okay. Come on out. It's just you and me, buddy. Come on, Han Solo. No, I guess he doesn't. Do I... No, that was shooting first. Yep. In the original version... Did you ever see the special edition of how they changed Han Solo? Not really, no. So it was... The story behind this whole argument is that in the original scene with Han and Greedo, Han just shoots Greedo because Greedo's being threatening and holding a gun up to him and Han has a hidden gun. Yeah. But, um... I guess George Lucas decided he didn't like how it made Han look like a cold-blooded killer because he wanted his character to be nicer for some reason. Who cares? Even though, yeah, I think it just makes Han smart. So they changed it and to make Greedo shoot first and then Han shoots. Do I have to shoot a lock? I think it's barred from the other side. Nope. Nope. Stand back! Normally we have a bar. All right, let's find a way to the harbor and hope the boat's still there. And, and then, oh, chapter ten. Two. Okay. And then they change it again. They change the scene again to make it so that it's a little closer. So now, in the most recent version, Han and Greedo both fire at the same, oh, at it's roughly so the weird. same time. Why? The weirdest part about it though is you have to look at Han's head when Greedo shoots at him because. This is footage from like 30 years oh. prior, and like his entire head like shifts, and it's this terrible computer effect of his head shifting to the side. Weird. It looks awful. I don't know what happened there. Yeah, me neither. What did it even- Elena died, somehow. Did you push her off something? No, I just went and found a boat. She's deathly afraid of boats. Apparently I just went the wrong way. These must be all the old ship manifests. Oh. Still seem to be in good shape. <sighs> hey, check this out. This looks right. The Esperanza sailed from Cayo, Peru, carrying 800 bars of gold, 1,200 silver emeralds, golden masks, ornaments. Whoa, silver. reading 16th century Spanish? Not just a grave robber after all, huh? Right here, gold statue, weight 20 arrobas. That's over 500 pounds. That's gotta be it. What's in a roba? Nothing, what's a roba with you? Wow. Oh, there you go. That are. was really hard. That was, that was like a stretch. I, I know, but I had to try. Huh, that's the last entry. That somebody special? What? Oh. Yeah, I was wondering about that yeah. ring before. I guess you could say that. Huh. I had you pegged as more of a woman in every port kind of guy. <laughs> Don't I wish. No, this was uh, this was Francis Drake's ring. I, you know, kind of inherited it. Oh, okay. Sick Parvis Magna? Greatness from small beginnings. It was his motto. Check out the date. 29th of January, 1596. One day after he supposedly died. Wait, what are these numbers right here? Coordinates. Right off the coast of Panama. Oh, so that's how you found the coffin. Yeah, that's right. See, Drake left this as a clue to pinpoint the exact burial site. For someone clever enough to figure it out. <laughs> yeah, nice try. 
but we're still going for that boat. So... Yeah, I'm afraid this is as close as we're getting to El Dorado. Somehow I don't think that's true. I want to see the, the full reality show that she shoots. <laughs> yeah. Publishes. Apparently someone's outside blowing the horn. Yeah, he's got that didgeridoo. Now, he has that ring because that ring was passed down through his family, right? And I was under the impression that his parents died from a pretty young age. So he waited until he was in his, like, what, 20s, 30s to finally follow the, the coordinates yeah. on that ring? Yeah. Maybe he didn't have it right away, I don't know. Okay, what do I have equipped? How the heck? Elena! Good job, Elena. She was the distraction. You're scaring the birds. No, those guys are scaring the birds. Yeah, no, that's what I meant this time. Elena couldn't hurt a fly because she never fires at anything. She just aims at the wall. I mean, she was firing a grenade launcher before, but that's because we were controlling her too, so I don't give her credit for that. I can't. Yeah, we could still only drive, but she couldn't fire while we were driving. Yeah. We could. We while we were moving was fine, as long as we weren't accelerating. <laughs> Elena's pretty cool. Just the the co-op experience isn't quite there yet, or whatever you want to call it. The a the AI, I guess. I know it's, it's not AI. technically AI. I don't know what else to call it, though. The game. <laughs> oh, she just got boomed. Again. Yeah, She's, wow. like, getting destroyed. See, I'm wondering how she died before a few minutes ago, because she's, like, made of titanium. Jeez. Oh, <laughs> She didn't even stop moving. She's the real hero here. <laughs> Gotta keep running. All right. But she still won't shoot it. Shoot at that guy. Oh. No, get behind. There we go. He's up in the upper right. I think. Ooh. Maybe not. I don't know where he is. Oh, he's right up there. That was not, good. That was not a good Ooh. run. I knew as soon as I went to that pillar, I was like, "This was a bad idea. I'm not safe here." Okay. Let's do this. Real <laughs> slow and stealthily. <laughs> That'd be pretty stealthy if Nathan wasn't going. Don't scare the birds. That that shotgun did not scare the birds, for the record. By the way, neither did my guns like. <laughs> the one flew away. <laughs> Getting shot scared the bird. <laughs> uh. Go birds! Go get help. Birdemic. Uh, one of the things I got my dad for Christmas was I got him a copy of The Room on Blu-ray. Oh, yeah. Because I've been, I've been showing him clips for years now, like ever since we discovered The Room. But he's never seen the whole thing, and he was really interested when the Disaster Artist movie was coming out. Did like, you watch it? No, he didn't want to see it because he's never seen The Room all the way through. Has he watched The Room yet is what I mean. Oh, no, not yet. Gave it to him can the we, other day. Can we, like, watch it with your dad? <laughs> I mean, I'll ask him. I, if we have the time, I wanted to watch it with him, too, so... I'm, sh I'm sure you'd be invited. Okay, that guy's a little scary. I think you can see him from there, though. No, you can't. Yeah, I think you can. Nope. If you get the angle quite right. No. Yeah. Or, or maybe if you go up on the stairs behind you. I would I can't I can't shoot it in front of the cover. <laughs> if you just close your eyes and believe. You killed that guy you. with like the second last bullet. Yep. Yep. -er. Yeah, you're gonna wanna take that guy out first. Yeah. 
See, my parents have just been, they're both retired now, and they've just been going to see all these different movies. They, they go to a movie, like, every Tuesday when it's really cheap now. Oh, yeah. Why well, don't they get Movie Pass? Um, yeah, they should. Or maybe they have it already, and I just don't know about and it. Then it's just, it's like, what, 15 bucks a month for unlimited movies or something? Yeah, I don't, I don't see my parents as much as I used to, but... <laughs> right between the eyes. Okay, mate. Crikey. Dingoes. That was the last game. Well, yeah, last game. Yeah, that was a section of the last game. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's the point of even coming up here? Uh, more ammo. Is that shiny? That's oh, shiny. yeah. We are novice fortune hunters. That was... <laughs> he just, like, did a cartwheel <laughs> off of there. That was something. Alright, well, I think we should stay here and enjoy this nice scenery oh, for a wait. little while longer. Is this time? Uh, maybe. Go, 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 No, go, I thought go, I heard go. it. It just, like, guillotines you right there. <laughs> That's one part of the, the accounting huh? game that was really weird, is you have to, like... I see any boat, Nate. Looks like we missed Yeah, I know what you're talking about. No, there it is. On the other side of the harbor. Come on. Hey, you know what? Why don't I just wait here and you can, uh, swing around and come back and pick me up? <laughs> okay, what are you up to? Nothing. I just want to, you know, stay here and get some more footage. I'll be safe. You'll be safe. There are right, dozens fine. of murderous, I promise highly you'll stay And you can't shoot a gun. Whatever that means. She's like bulletproof, though. If we just give her a bat, she could she could do this whole thing. All right, so next time I guess we're gonna meet her across the harbor. Oh yeah, this is this is what her documentary's been missing—just some like good ocean footage mm -hmm. that she could probably get as stock. With you know some gun ammo lying down on the ground. Yeah. Hey. Get a few frames of this guy. Let me go 